Hi friends! Today, I'm visiting my chemist friend, to learn all about matter. Hi Dr. Hawking! Thanks for inviting me! Hello Owen, I'm happy you could be here. Are you ready to learn more about matter? I am. I know a few things already. Would you like me to tell you what I know? Yes, please do. I know that, everything we can touch and see, is made up of matter. Matter, is something that is mass, or weight, and takes up space. Matter, has three main phases, solid, liquid, and gas. Great job! You already know so much. Let's talk about conservation of matter. What does the word conservation mean, Dr. Hakim? Conservation, means protection, that something cannot be destroyed. There is a rule, called the law of conservation of matter. This law states that, the amount of matter stays the same, even if the substance changes. Hmm. What do you mean, when the substance changes, the amount still stays the same? What that means is that, when matter changes from one form to another, the amount still stays the same. Matter cannot just appear or disappear. It is always there. The form of the matter changes, but the amount will be the same. It will never just vanish. I think I understand. Matter cannot be created, or destroyed. It just exists. You've got it. Now, when we change matter from one form to another, it will still have the same amount, even if it looks like it has disappeared. For example, let's look at this glass of ice water. When we weigh the glass of ice water it is 300 grams. Now, the ice will melt, since it is warm here. See how even when the ice melts, the weight of the water stays the same. That is because matter, in this case the ice, is a solid, and does not disappear when the substance changes, or when the ice melts. Wow! I didn't know that! How cool! What happens then, if I boil the water? Great question, Owen. When we boil water, it looks like the water is disappearing. It is actually just changing to a different state of matter. It is going from a liquid to a gas. See how steam is coming off of the boiling water. The matter still exists, it's just in a different form. What happens if I add something to the glass of water? Like when my Nana adds sugar to her tea? Does that change the amount of matter? It might seem like the amount would change, but actually it still stays the same. Let's add sugar to this glass of water and then calculate the mass. See how it weighs 350 grams. Now when we stir the sugar it will eventually dissolve. I know what dissolve means. It is when something is mixed in with another substance, to form a solution. Correct. That matter still exists, we just cannot see it because it has dissolved into the water. If we were to boil the water for a very long time, eventually we would be able to separate the sugar matter out as it returns to a solid. Wow! I've learned so much more about matter. Let's review. Matter, is anything with mass, that takes up space. Matter, comes in three states, solid, liquid, and gas. The law of conservation of matter is a rule, that says that the amount of matter stays the same, even when the substance changes form. Like, when ice melts, or when water boils. When two substances are combined, like sugar added to water, the amount of matter stays the same, even as the sugar dissolves. Excellent! I'm glad you have learned so much. Thank you for teaching me, Dr. Hakim.